When you hear farmers say John Deere 2010, you can bet your life they're talking about the most usable 45 horsepower ever harnessed for row crop farming. Spirited new generation tractors, abundantly powered with diesel, gasoline, or LP gas engines. Two great models, either of which can carry the full workload on many row crop farms. Here's the low-built, sure-footed 2010 row crop utility the new pace setter among tractors for all round work. The easiest mounting tractor you ever saw. It hugs the ground for great stability on slopes, yet it gives you nearly 20 inches clearance, and it handles all kinds of equipment, including front-mounted four-row cultivators. Here's the 2010 row crop tractor, a real champion for broad versatility. It handles tools for the complete farming job, including mounted corn and cotton pickers. Comfort and convenience, as never before, are woven into the design of these new generation tractors. But the big overshadowing story is the matching of new variable speed engines and new synchro range transmission to produce more flexible, more efficient power than anything in farm tractor history. With the engine throttle and transmission shift lever, you have complete command of fully flexible power. Power that performs with great efficiency when the engine is revved up and the transmission is in a low gear for heavy jobs. And with utmost fuel economy when the engine is throttled down in a high gear for light jobs. Here's flexible power at its best. An infinite number of ground speeds from a slow creeper gear up to nearly 20 miles an hour. It's efficient, full-governed power all the way. Heart of this power team is the John Deere four-cylinder variable speed engine. It's brand new, yet fully tested, built to John Deere's exacting standards. This speed hour meter shows controlled engine speeds from 600 to 2500 RPM. From 1500 to 2500 RPM is the full-governed operating range. Up to 45 horsepower can be delivered instantly on demand. You control the new synchro range transmission with this handy lever. As you move the lever down through eight forward positions in four ranges, the speeds increase progressively. Each range offers many speeds. In range three, for example, fifth and sixth forward positions provide all ground speeds from about five miles to about 11 and a half miles per hour and reverse speeds of about five to nine miles per hour, according to the throttle setting of the engine. Collars shown in the transmission here are shifted instead of gears. Synchronizers make on-the-go shifting within each range fast and easy. Every 2010 tractor has this speed hour meter, which shows engine speed, power shaft speed, ground speed, and total hours of operation. You can tell at a glance what your power team is doing. An efficient foot clutch leaves your hands free to steer and handle equipment. Individual self-energizing disc type brakes provide quick positive stops and aid in making short turns at row ends. Another important feature of the new generation of earning power is the new big capacity hydraulic system with dash-mounted controls, this system offers you equipment control through one, two, or three independent hydraulic circuits. You have single rock shaft, dual rock shaft, and remote cylinder control. This gear-type pump provides live hydraulic force for fast operation of all hydraulic functions. An abundant reserve of oil supplies both the transmission and the hydraulic system. This pedal disengages the hydraulic pump while the engine is being started. Makes it easier to start your engine during cold weather. Here's the rock shaft lift arm shown in high position and low position. With the wide range, you can raise three-point tools up high for transport and penetrate the soil fast and deep with tillage tools. A front rock shaft operates by linkage from the rear rock shaft for either single or dual functions. Front cultivator rigs can be raised by the front rock shaft while rear rigs are still in the ground. This universal three-point hitch is operated by the rear rock shaft. With the hitch, you can handle all types of tools, 
change tools quickly, make close couplings and easy adjustments. And with three-point equipment, you don't have to pay for wheels, bearings, and jack stands. Sway blocks, a brand new feature, positively lock out sway of either category one or category two equipment. Swing the block up and tools such as plows will trail freely, follow the furrow. Collars on the lift links provide a floating action, permit tools with gauge wheels to follow ground contours. With telescoping draft links, it's easy to attach three-point tools. A convenient turnbuckle on the center link simplifies attaching. Fore and aft adjusting is easy from the tractor seat. Lateral adjustment is also easy using the screw crank at the top of the right lift link. Will the operator please turn the record? This great new quick coupler makes possible instant hitching or unhitching of three-point tools. The operator doesn't have to leave the tractor seat. Just back the tractor so quick coupler hooks are in approximate position beneath the implement crossbar and raise the hitch. The hooks snatch the crossbar, locks snap in place, and the job is done. Detaching is just as fast and easy. The unique hydraulic system of the 2010 series tractors offers you load control, depth control, and load and depth control. This quadrant contains a hydraulic selective lever which determines three-point hitch response. In load control position, the hydraulic system automatically raises or lowers three-point hitch tools to conform to a pre-selected limit. In depth control position, the hydraulic sensing system is locked out and working depth of a tool is constant. The tool is under manual operation with the control lever. In this position, you get fully automatic load and depth control, which is ideal for soils of varying texture. Load and depth control provides the most uniform working depth possible with just enough draft reaction and weight transfer to let the tractor pull through difficult soil conditions at steady pace. An independent live power takeoff provides both 1,000 and 540 RPM speeds. The shaft is shown here in 540 RPM position with the 1,000 outlet below. This reversible stub shaft is splined to fit both the 1,000 and 540 RPM outlets. You're equipped to accommodate both present and future power-driven tools. With this convenient lever, you can engage or disengage the PTO clutch at any time. You can operate the PTO at correct speed throughout the whole transmission range so any crop condition can be matched to proper ground speed. A heavy duty draw bar will meet all your needs for drawn equipment. It may be set in long or short position, high or low, locked or swinging. These features combine to help make a 2010 the most usable 45 horsepower ever offered for row crop farming. But that's only part of the story. For comfort and convenience, you've never seen anything like it. Take this deluxe seat, for example. It was developed by a top flight team of John Deere engineers, industrial designers, and independent medical consultants to provide you with the ultimate in relaxed comfort. The seat is placed well ahead of the rear axle, away from the severe bump zone. It's suspended on adjustable torsion springs, which cushion out jolts and bounces. Variable density foam rubber provides firm or soft cushioning as needed for seat, back, and sides. With this handy lever, you can move the seat up and back or down and forward to adjust to operators with long or short legs. Adjustments for weight and for locking the seat in position are at the front. This latch releases the seat when the operator wants to stand. Stand up and the seat automatically moves back and up leaving plenty of room on the uncluttered, spacious platform to stretch and move around. Sit down, and the seat returns to its original position. You can see where you are going and what you're doing, too, thanks to the clean design of the tractor. All controls are at your fingertips. A new generation 2010 lets you work relaxed all day.
John Deere Power Steering helps keep you fresh all day. It's better than ever now, smoother, faster acting. Double hydraulic pistons apply a powerful turning force to the wheels. This quick acting power steering makes it easy to control the tractor in soft, loose soil, rough ground, or mud, even with heavy front-mounted equipment. When the engine is not running, the tractor can be steered manually. Lights of several types are available for night work. Here's a row crop utility with fender-mounted lights. This economy fender on the 2010 row crop has a single headlight, while this one has deluxe fenders and dual front lights. In addition, there's the tail lamp, tractor warning lamp, and an implement warning lamp to help make your night work safe as well as convenient. With a variety of wheel assemblies and adjustments, you can readily adapt these tractors to all crops and farm jobs. On this 2010 row crop, the adjustable front axle offers wheel treads of 50 to 79 inches. Rear wheel tread may be adjusted from 56 to 93 inches. Conventional dual front wheels are available. Or you can get rollomatic front wheels, which provide knee action to reduce front end bounce by half. Or a single front wheel for work in very narrow rows. For the 2010 row crop utility, two front axles are available. The straight axle is shown here. A swept back axle offers shorter wheelbase for extra easy maneuverability. Both front axles provide wheel treads of 50 to 79 inches. You can quickly change rear wheel spacings by using engine power. There's a 60 to 88 inch rear wheel spread on the row crop and 56 to 80 inches on the row crop utility. During the past few minutes, we've only hit the high spots of these great new generation John Deere 2010 tractors. Now we invite you to drive one of these new tractors. Because only on the seat, actually working equipment, can you get the true feeling of the new generation of power. The conviction that here indeed is the tractor for you the most usable 45 horsepower ever harnessed for row crop farming, a John Deere 2010.